Hi. <clears throat> I'm here now at Speaker's Corner. Oh no. Sorry. I'm going there later. But I'm at Stratford at the moment. As you can see, Stratford Station. Where the people wants to go. Especially when uh, so today because of London Wine. Now uh, I'd like to to share with you these things that you need to know because many people they were confused especially with regards to religion. One of the the things that asked uh, is your religion or are your religions the right thing or the right gospel that what God tells the world with regards to Christ, Jesus Christ. Uh, before I will uh, start, all things you need to know is for you to properly uh, know the truth, all you need to do is first you need to study the Holy Word of God. Because when you pray, when you pray, you talk to God. But when God talks to you, by reading the Word of God. I am be aware of the moment on this place because even you live or stay in UK, it's very dangerous now. Why? Because people will just snatch your smartphone, get a friend whose uh, smartphone was stolen there at Oxford and the other friend of Upton Park. This why right, this uh, iPhone I'm holding now, there's a lock at the back of this. And I was uh, very cautious looking at somebody with car and uh, snatch my phone. So anyway, I'll con I will continue now. So after reading, studying the Word of God for at least three years, same as uh, Paul did, he was sold before, but he went to Damascus. And at Damascus, as we can uh, study what happened there, he studied for three years until uh, Saul, who becomes Paul, Apostle of Christ, reappear again and become a powerful ser servant of God. He's uh, doing great things with signs and wonders. Even uh, when he lay his hands, people were wholly baptized. And the signs that they received the Holy Spirit by speaking in other tongues. Meaning, it is no other tongues, but it's a language that God gave. You can see the vision in Acts chapter 12 by I me, mean, to the official believers, 12 were baptized. So after you read it, so there will be now comparison to what any people will tell you with regards to the religion. So first, you need to know, at least within three years, study well the Word of God. The Word of God which is the Bible. This is why it was called the Word of God, because it is the Bible, the Bible, the Holy Scriptures. So that's the requirement. You have three years study, but uh, to be a good example of servants of God through Jesus Christ, repent, ask forgiveness to God, attend a church, a Pentecostal God-giving 
God leading church who will water baptize you once you repent and you need to ask the Holy Spirit Acts 2 4 so that you will speak in other tongues and as you speak other tongues uh, that's the sign you receive the Holy Spirit now you repent you will water baptized you believe and you receive the Holy Spirit so I think you will be ready ready my friend to talk with other people who will come and face you and ask you regarding the message of Christ that what you share is really the truth so now after you were water baptized after you received the Holy Spirit and you've got the signs of speaking in other tongues read and study for three years the Word of God morning and evening if you're working you can do that morning and evening and if you don't have car you travel you bring a little Bible old and new do it because I, I knew a man more than 40 years is studying the Word of God until now and you will be not misled by many false religion false meaning lying lying religion lying prophet false meaning lying prophet yeah so you need to be very careful so how can you determine that uh, the person you're talking to or the person you sharing something is uh, the right person or not first whatever they are telling you you need to compare with the word of God if he's talking with regards to the word of God the Bible you might uh, think as well that he's from God because uh, he's using the Bible but be careful because there is a oneness the Father the Son the Holy Spirit they are one it's not from God it's not from God because there is one Father which is greater than Jesus and there is the Holy Spirit uh, which we received when we were holy baptized through the signs of speaking the other tongues so that's it be careful always be careful Matthew 3 last verse says Jesus was holy water baptized uh, he was uh, baptized by John rising from the water then the Holy Spirit John the Baptist so like a dog and the father in heaven says here is my son which I please in Matthew 17 the father said here is my son my begotten son that I please hear him so that's uh, all for now and I will continue to share this series so that you might know and be useful for God's uh, presence. We pray that you receive uh, first Jesus, repent of your sin, enter in your room, ask forgiveness, whatever sins you have done against God, ask the Holy Spirit, and you need to have a church. Because as evangelists, we share the gospel, good news of Christ. But the pastors, the leaders, the teachers of the church, they are the ones who will nurture the seed that was we plant in your heart. And the pastors or leaders of the church will water the seed that we have planted in your heart. Then God will make it grow. First Corinthians chapter 1. And all the glory will only come and belongs and give it 
to our God in heaven, named the Father, Jesus told us. The Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, three persons in one God, as you are, the body, soul, and spirit. But this is a higher teaching, but God willing, I'll do it as a series. I will teach everything with God's help, everything that I know with regards to the Holy Word of God. Again, my friend, thank you for watching, subscribing, and liking my video. God bless. Bye for now. See you later. Bye.